What's up, you guys? This is Karmic and Dean, season 10, where we talk about karmic situations that could be going on in your life at this time that you need to be aware of, or this could just be confirmation that you made the right decision or you're currently making the right decision. Archangels, spirit guides, ancestors of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel these current ancestor messages for the collective. Ancestors of my highest good, please give me clear and accurate messages. Thank you guys for all the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes, the emails, the bookings, the donations. I appreciate you guys for all the love and the support you show to me on the channel. I appreciate you. And all the other information about me with the other platforms I am on will be down below in the description box. All right, you guys. All right, so let's get into it, collective, and see what is going on. What should you know at this time? Let's see. I appreciate y'all. Let's see. Investments. Invest wisely. Okay. Savings. Create savings for a future. Okay. So for some of you guys, I'm hearing there's an investment that you're going to make that's going to increase your savings is what I just heard. You have looking, seeking, you will find. So for some of you guys, you're looking for something to invest in that's going to like, you know, make you money or something like that. So I'm hearing you about to get into an investment that's going to increase your savings. For some of you guys, whatever investment this is, you're going to be able to, to start saving if you wasn't able to save. And for others of you, it's going to increase your savings. So you're going to be making more in something in an investment. So there's an investment you're going to make and it's going to be very fruitful. So you have an investment coming in here. That's awesome energy collective. Okay, period. Awesome energy. So some about the investment is coming towards you here. Okay. Very, very fruitful. Okay. It's something to do with savings. Okay. So your ancestors could be encouraging you to save more or find more ways to save. Okay. Is what I'm seeing here so for some of y'all your ancestors are asking you to save more okay so if you are already saving your ancestors could be saying that you could do more that's what i'm hearing okay or start saving all right let's see ancestors all right so we got the queen of swords what else we got the moon card, all right, and the ten of wands. So for some of y'all, something to do with an attorney, okay? Something to do with an attorney could be significant. Okay, we got ten of wands. So for some of y'all, there could be a situation about an attorney, Somebody is like high in something here in a situation to try to make somebody roll hard. Something about somebody could be trying to find a way to sue you is what I'm hearing. Somebody is trying to find a way to sue you. Yeah, ten of wands. Because for some of y'all, this person could blame you for their role being hard in a situation. That's what I'm hearing. So this person is trying to find a way to sue you to get money from you. Okay, this could be a jealous family member. For some of y'all, for others of you, this could be your mother. Okay. Let's see. What's going on, spirit? Yeah, two of wands, hell yeah. Because whoever this person is, they fit, they think it's like this person feel like you leaving them behind in the situation. So this person is trying to figure out a way to stay attached to you. If they can't stay attached to you, it's like this person trying to get you caught up so they can get money from you. Okay, some kind of way. Yeah. Hermit. What else? Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, this person is like secretly working on this shit. 
sun card. You got Aries, Sagittarius, Virgo, strong Virgo. You got Leo. It's like this person is trying to secretly figure out a way to get your role hard in the situation. Somebody could work for the gov government or something like that. Some do a September 9th, September 19th. Yeah, it's like for some of y'all, this person has like they this person this person study magic. Like they know like magic and stuff, whether you know this or not. Okay, this is your mom, like this person know magic. Even if they haven't told you, this person has dibbled and dabbled in some shit before, is what I'm hearing. But this person is not gonna tell you that though. <laughs> That's what I just heard. They're not gonna tell you that, but they have though. Yep. But for some of y'all, this is giving me like a very jealous mother. Okay, this is a very jealous mother here. And for some of y'all, whoever this person is, it's like, I just feel like you gonna start not looking at this person the same no more. Like when you find out what this person is trying to link and do to try to get money from you or trying to get money off of you. For some of you guys, I'm hearing something about a secret um, insurance policy or something on you as well. Okay, so for some of y'all, somebody is like try try to get you taken out off of an insurance policy, but this person's hiding that. Yep, they hiding that. That that's what they did. Try to get you taken out for insurance policy. That's fucked up. That's what I just heard. So your ancestors want you to know that that they are protecting you from that. This is the grandchildren card at the bottom of the deck. They are protecting you from that. Okay, from this energy. Yeah, with this jealous ass motherfucking mother. This is fucked up for somebody. Yeah, re-energize your life. Okay. What else? Yeah, balance yourself. So your ancestors want you to really like balance yourself in your life here. I feel like for some of y'all, you're going to realize that you need to cut this mother off okay you need to cut her off yeah your prayers has been heard here but you have to cut this person off though yeah and that's the truth yeah plant medicine yeah something to do with deities and entities okay so if you work with like deities and entities you can have deities around you that is willing to help you in a situation if you need okay so those that's only for the ones y'all know okay something about somebody growing growing their own okay whatever that is i'm seeing somebody growing something here okay from the ground up here and your prayers is being answered when it comes to balancing that situation out okay your ancestors heard your cry they heard what you were saying here okay that's what i'm seeing Let's see. Current energy. Yeah, we got work through your fears. Adjustments are required. What else? A personal issue is going to reach a resolution. Protective guardian. Be brave and honest. And communication is key. Okay, so I feel like for a lot of you guys, you're going to be led to be brave and honest when it comes to communication. There could be somebody in this energy that's afraid of saying something and afraid of being honest in a situation. But I'm hearing like whatever somebody is going to communicate, it actually will resolve a whole like issue. Like people underestimate how powerful communication really is in the situation like sometimes all it takes is an honest conversation that'll take maybe a few minutes and it could iron something out that people been you know keeping inside of them for months and it take a five minute conversation you know to hash things out you know what i'm saying so it's like somebody could be afraid of like 
saying something but i'm hearing like that's the adjustment that's needed to like make a situation like smoothing out you know what i mean like communication is like the key to this whole situation it really is it's the key to unlock some confusion all right when it comes to a situation like somebody just needs to open their mouth and be brave and honest about what they feel and drop their protective shield like i'm hearing like you're safe you're safe to communicate. You're safe to say what it is that you need and want to say. Okay? With whoever that's for. Because I feel like whoever that's for is going to hit that person. Flat out. That's what I feel, collective. Let's see. Alright, let's see. What's the tea? What's the tea? What's the tea? Somebody crying over you? This could be somebody that don't have a car. Or this could be somebody having car issues. Yeah, this is an obsessive person that you could be ignoring. All right? But whoever this person is, they really are into you here. <laughs> they really into you, collective. So let's see who this is. All right, let's see. What's going on? What's going on, spirit? Yeah, we got Page of Cups. Somebody's very immature. Yeah, they're very immature. Whoever this person is, they immature as fuck. Yeah, you got the Six of Cups, Ace of Swords. Yeah, King of Wands, Seven of Swords, Seven of Cups, and Ace of Wands. Whoever this person is, I feel like that this person... Somebody could have figured out about what somebody has been lying about. There could be a pregnancy involved as well. And I feel like for some of y'all, whoever this person is, I feel like that somebody could blame you. Somebody could blame you about what they going through, but it ain't got nothing to do with you. Okay? Whoever this person is, I feel like that somebody could be upset and trying to accuse you of something that's not true. Okay? Somebody could feel like that you secretly talking to somebody that they want to be with. It's like, no, you're not. <laughs> All right? Is what I'm seeing. Somebody, because I'm hearing somebody could have said something about your intelligence. Somebody could have said how they admire your intelligence or something like that is what I'm hearing. And that could have made somebody feel like that somebody was like wanting to be with you or something. Or that you was like secretly talking to this person. Because they could have said something like about you in a like... Like, oh, I admire that, that person's, I'm hearing intelligence. I admire that person's intelligence. I admire the way that person think or their view of life. And somebody could have taken that as, oh, well, y'all sneaking around behind my back kind of energy. Like, that's what I'm getting. Like, oh, y'all sneaking behind my back. What y'all doing? Like, that vibe. <laughs> like, what y'all doing? like kind of energy all right that's what i'm seeing yep that's crazy for some of y'all this is somebody that you do not want that that wants you they want you they stuck on you you don't give a fuck about this person all right i'm here for some of y'all you like if it ain't about the kids i ain't tripping on you all right, but somebody always got their name in your mouth, got got your name in their mouth. Like, they always do. And I'm hearing somebody, it makes somebody think that there is something going on with y'all too, and it's not. Okay, and it's breaking somebody's heart here. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm hearing somebody keep comparing. Somebody keep comparing, like, two people. And it's like... It's really starting to fuck up somebody mental because somebody could start to feel like that they're not enough or something. 
All right, is what I'm hearing. Yeah, that's what I just heard, y'all. So this could be like a sad person. This don't have to be a person crying over you. This could just be a sad ass person in your energy and shit. Okay. Yep. This is crazy. So that sign could be you got strong Scorpio, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. All right, strong Aquarius, Aries, Leo, Sag. Okay. Let's see. Mystery Bobcat. The Bobcat teaches you that there is true power and strength in silence and patience. In order to get what you want, you must be willing to plan, adapt, and above all, have the patience to see your dreams manifest. And you have peace. The gentle nature of the dolphin reminds you to look for the good in everyone and strive to bring peace to your life and those around you. Trust your instincts and intuition rather than overthinking things. So for some of y'all, you've been overthinking shit and your ancestors and spirit guides want you to stop doing that. Stop overthinking shit that you already know the answer to for real. Okay? You already know the answer. You have the clarity. Stop overthinking. You already know what's up. Okay? Overthinking creates delays. Okay? <laughs> I know. Okay? Listen. I be overthinking like a motherfucker sometimes. <laughs> okay? Listen. It creates delays. When all you're going to do is go with your first mind anyway. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It, it comes down to that. You going with your first mind. You just be overthinking, creating delays for your own fucking self when you just going to wind up doing the first thing anyway. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it's like, just do it, yo. Stop overthinking. Or stop like wasting your time, other people's time. Okay, right leg in their thigh tattoo. Okay, this is also like somebody wanting to be with somebody, <clears throat> but they could be trying to date a whole bunch of people to try to get over one person, knowing damn well you can't get over that person or some shit. Like you trying to fight your feelings on how you feel about somebody. Like you know somebody, your person, but you fighting it. And you trying to feel... You know, like going to other people and shit. When you know they're not gonna fulfill you, you know what you know what it is. You know who it is. Stop playing. <laughs> All right. Stop playing. Look at this shit. <laughs> obsessed. I'm telling you, yo. Somebody is obsessed. V, somebody can drive a van. N, S, K. Somebody can have right arm tattoos. You got 50s. Chill vibe. Black magic was put on your appearance. Sports. You got Leo. Big chest. You got T. Gap T. You got Jamaican. Mental health issues, dimples, you got you, flip-flop lover, cleansing is needed, so if you did not do a cleansing, okay, dark liquor, bald head, some do a three or a Pisces, you got foot tattoo, you have wine, some do a flight could be significant, you got Native American, Somebody can have an accent, 70s. Best sex or love with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Somebody that love wearing lip color. You got multiple ear piercings. Best sex or love with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag. Engaged. Gemini, Z. Lawyer. Smoke cigars. Boat or a yacht. You got thin eyebrows. Fully tatted. Some do it Aquarius. You got Nike. You got X. 
leather jackets. You got A, some of do an Arizona five or a Taurus. Some of do it a fake ass emperor truck. <laughs> you got Mohawk. Huge increase. You got SUV, pills, tea, colorful socks. You got dancer. Okay. Some of do a Tasha could be significant. 35 or 53. I heard Utah. All right. Let's see. What else, Spirit? I heard Santana. I heard Antonio. I heard Tenskia. Tenskia. I heard Takia. Something to do with taxes. Somebody could do taxes. Okay, I heard something about tax fraud. All right, I heard Nastasha. Okay, I heard Tasia. All right, I heard Canton. Canton. All right. Somebody, what else, spirit? Something about tanning. So somebody could have went tanning today. Okay, I'm seeing that. I heard Sutra. Sutra. Okay. I heard Santana. Santana. Okay. That's crazy. I heard Zane. Zane. That's crazy. Something to do with a life path number five, life path number three. Okay. I heard Tavion. Okay, Tavion. I heard Tarzan. Okay. All right, you guys. I really hope that these messages helped you or gave you some kind of clarity in your situation. All right, like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me. And until next time, peace.